Namaste, Soul Tribe, Spiritual Healer, back to give you a message. Hi, my beautiful Aries, my baby bosses. Here I am once again. I love you guys. I'm always getting messages for you guys. I'm always getting channel messages, okay? So this channel messages, this channel messages that I got here is hot off the press. I just got these messages, so let's go. Okay, literally, literally, this is what I heard. This is what I heard. This is why I came on um to to record this video i'm kind of feeling excited okay so i have this feeling of excitement some of you guys could be having this overwhelming feeling of excitement or joy okay surrounding your energy fields because you guys have att been attracting this major blessing or opportunity or you guys been working so hard and diligently like on your on your spiritual uh gifts you guys are working to master your gifts master your skills and develop uh, this sort of confidence about yourself that can never be destroyed. Okay, so your confidence is increasing. That is beautiful. Okay, Aries, I heard this this when I was channeling your messages, and I didn't write this down because I just heard it right before I pressed record. I, I started hearing this. Making a list, I'm checking it twice. I'm going to find out who's naughty or nice. Ancestors are coming to town. I can't make it up. I heard that. So it's almost like Christmas, okay? So we're in the Christmas season, Christmas month, okay? Heading into December. And your ancestors, they've been making a list. They've been checking it twice. They know who's naughty and who's nice in your energy. They know who has bad intentions towards you and who is good in your energy. And there's like a few people in your energy that are good and a whole bunch of people that are on the naughty list. That's what I heard. I can't make it up, okay? Some of you guys could be doing a Christmas list at this time. Or somebody, some of you guys are just like writing a list, writing things down, journaling, journaling your messages, channeling messages. Okay, so I also got a message that Oya is furious. So if you guys don't know who Oya is, some of you guys might have this deity that protects you, that surrounds you. Oya is um, basically, Oya is a deity of the forest. So Oya is the warrior of the forest, the trees, the nature, the plants, okay? Exotic birds. You guys could be seeing exotic birds at this time. I'm getting exotic birds, okay, are in the forest. All types of forest animals are in the forest. So a lot of ancestors, spirit guides, spirit animals coming to the light here, coming to the forefront. Okay, I also heard skunk. When I was channeling your messages, I heard skunk. I seen a skunk in my mind's eye, a black and white skunk, a huge skunk. Somebody here could be smelling skunk. When you walk outside, a skunk could have sprayed, or you could be seeing a skunk, or a skunk is significant to one of these ancestors. Um, Oya is using a skunk, spirit animal, literally uh, to blind these karmics in your energy. Somebody here was trying to use your own ancestors against you. That's what I'm getting, and that's why Oya is furious. Okay, so Oya, you guys might want to go check out who she is. If you don't know who she is, she's a very powerful deity of the forest, okay? So Oya is furious because a family member or an ex or a group of people tried to use your own ancestors against you, and it's coming back on them ten times fold. Okay, so yeah. Then I heard windstorm. Okay, somebody here could be experiencing a major windstorm in their area, in their community, in their state. A windstorm is causing power outages, so Oya is not playing. Somebody was trolling you online, scammers, people trolling you in the comment sections. If you're a content creator and you're online, if you're a tarot reader or whatever you do um, for your business, you could be posting online on, on a website, but somebody's really trying to troll you online trying to discourage you, um, some sort of scammer here is trying to project their dark energy onto you. Just block these people or these individuals or report them, okay? Your ancestors are handling this behind the scenes. Okay, for some of you guys watching, you guys have access to Book of Secrets because I got the Book of Secrets here. Okay, just bear with me. All these messages are random messages that could resonate with someone watching. The Book of Secrets, okay? So you guys have open Pandora's box. Somebody opened Pandora's box. I heard Pandora's box. Okay, Book of Secrets, Akashic Records. You guys are tapping into your Akashic Records. You guys are becoming masterminds, master alchemists. I heard mad scientists. Okay, so mad scientists. Somebody here could be researching science or somebody's a mad scientist here. It could be, it could be in the government as well because I also heard exposed CEO or boss or company. 
okay, experimenting drugs, experimental drugs, okay, causing people illnesses. So there's some sort of company or CEO boss that's getting sued for something that they have created or a product that's causing people illness. This could be a product, this could be a, a, a chemical, this could be like anything. Okay, so there's a major corporation or company. You guys could be receiving a compensation from this. Okay, some sort of settlement money you could be um, expecting or you could be qualifying for this because some CEO company or boss started doing some experimental drugs or something that was experimental here. Okay, I also heard nanobots. Okay, something about nanobots. Somebody here, like I said, is a mad scientist. Somebody here researches nanobots or nanotechnology, mad scientists, experimental drug, CEO boss, corporation getting exposed. This uh, experimental drug is causing illness or and this is going to create a major um, tower in the masses. Okay, for anybody who has uh, taken this drug or this product, okay, that might be significant. Volcanoes, okay, I'm getting a volcano erupting. So volcanoes are erupting. Volcano, I'm getting... um. Okay, wow. I'm getting Shango energy. For somebody watching, you got deities with you. I got Shango energy for volcanoes. Something is erupting. Someone, Someone's place could be on fire. Someone's life could be deteriorating. Or a volcano could be happening on Earth somewhere in the masses. Okay, I heard Hawaii. Okay, I heard Hawaii. Earth is shifting, okay, so our Earth could be shifting, that's causing volcanoes to happen. Somebody um, is going to the beach or water and sand is significant here. You might want to take some water and sand home with you, put water and sand in a jar and take it home. Your ancestors are wanting you to take sand and water from the beach home, put it in a jar and um, manifest with that. That's for somebody that can protect you, your ancestors could use that, okay, so then I heard Ohio, something could be significant about Ohio, and then I heard there's a family or there's a community, a predator in this community or family that's getting arrested, okay, this could be on the news or TV. Somebody could be riding in a motorcycle or a bicycle, like them, them, them motorbikes, okay, or a motorcycle, they could be having a major accident, be careful if you're riding a motorcycle or a bike, you could have an accident. Or that was orchestrated. Somebody wanted you to pass away. Or somebody here could be passing away from this motorcycle accident or bike accident. Be mindful. Okay? I heard white Cadillac. I heard somebody has a convertible or a truck or a van. And then I heard the name Opal. Somebody could be named Opal or Opal could be a stone. Somebody has a stone that's an Opal or somebody's name is Opal. I heard Pearl. Somebody has a pearl necklace or pearls. Okay? Or somebody's gifting you this. Or a pearl is significant. Someone's name could be Pearl. I heard Benjamin, okay, somebody's name could be Benjamin or Jermaine. I heard Tyreek or Tyreka. I heard Robert or Roberta. I heard Julian or Julius. I heard Jules, okay, Julie or July. Something happened in July. Somebody's exposed, okay. Let's get the messages. I'm going to pull some cards, my beautiful Aries. Let's get some cards. I'm going to pull the Kipper deck. And then I'm going to clarify each card of the Kipper deck. So let's, let me get five cards for the Aries energy. Thank you so much, Aries, for watching the video, for your love, for your shares, subscribes. I love you guys. Keep on rising and shining. Keep on transmuting energy. You guys are on the right path. You guys are seeing things clear. You guys are sick and tired of people betraying you and lying to you. So you are no longer lying to yourself in a situation. You're being very honest with yourself. Like I said, somebody watching is a mad scientist. Somebody here can 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 uh, is really good at science or they're experimenting something or they're researching something. They're having a major breakthrough or something's being exposed in the masses with, with some sort of um, experimental drugs here that could be causing you know, a huge lawsuit here, okay, give me a, give me like four cards, thank you spirit, first card is change, okay, sudden change, okay, like I said, sudden change, something's happening suddenly, 999 energy, you can be seeing those numbers, okay, privileged lady, wow, beautiful energy, you guys could be the privileged lady in a situation, or you're dealing with a privileged lady here, Okay, 1212 energy. The number 12 might be significant. Number 9, your birthday could be on the 9th or the 12th. If you're watching this video, your birthday could be on the 9th or the 12th of the month. Okay, yeah, 29. Somebody's birthday could be on the 29th. Imprisonment. Somebody wanted to have you imprisoned in your own mind, have you in mental prison, have you in conflict, have you in fear, 
have you um, tried to orchestrate something to happen to get you caught up in the justice system? Or somebody's headed to prison because they overdid their manipulation? Yeah. Woo. Mature man. Something could be happening with the mature man in your life. Mature male energy here. Okay, spirit. So um, I'm going to clarify this energy here with the tarot. Wow. Okay. Let's, let's clarify this energy, spirit. For the beautiful Aries, my baby bosses watching this video. Okay, with the change. What's happening and what's going on with this sudden change in your life here? Or in someone's life is going to take a, a toll, a sudden change in someone's life. The tables are turning. The energy is shifting. Like I said, the earth is shifting. Okay, so sudden change. Okay. What's the message for change for the beautiful Aries? Clarify the change card here. Thank you, spirit. Ooh, there's a sudden change for a toxic hermit in reverse. Dark empath energy in your life. Okay, this person could be losing their home. They could be losing something. They could be uh, getting kicked out of a situation. Or the sudden changes that you, you are finding out the truth about a dark empath in your life. And you're walking away. Somebody could be getting a divorce over a betrayal. Walking away, a sudden ending. You're seeing the truth about this Virgo or this hermit in reverse. Okay? Wow. Sudden change. Wow. Sudden change is that you have the Ten of Cups now. Okay? Because you figured them out. You figured them out. Like, you know what you know. And these people also, or this person knows what you know that you know. Okay? Just just so you know. Wow. A lot of that. Okay? Eight of Cups. Um, ten of Cups. Okay? So, sudden change is that you guys could be relocating. You guys could have a sudden windfall of money. And you are able to relocate or you started something new for yourself. You are blowing up. You are going viral or something's bringing you the Ten of Cups. Happy energy, fulfillment energy, joy, success, happy union, partnership, ten of cups. You could be seeing ten ten. Somebody's birthday could be on the 10th. If you're watching, your birthday could be on the 10th of the month. Ten ten, okay, energy. Oh, wow, ten of cups and the knight of wands, okay? So sudden change is that there's a knight of wands, Aries Leo Sag energy that wants to come towards you, that sees the ten of cups with you, that's walking away from a dark empath or a karmic, okay? Yeah, sudden change. Is coming. Privileged lady. Let's clarify the privileged lady. Who is this privileged lady? This could be you or someone else. Wow. Somebody's in the Ten of Swords over this privileged lady. Okay. So somebody's obsessed with you or someone else is a privileged lady. And someone's going through the Ten of Swords over this, over your abundance, over your level up. Like I said before, the, this person could be binded to something now. They put out some dark energy towards you. They, they they didn't put respect on your name or they slandered your name or they gossiped or they lied on you and they betrayed you here. Now they're in the Ten of Swords. Yeah, because you walked away from this dark empath. Came out again. This came out again. I put it back in the deck. You guys saw me shuffle, right? So this Hermit in Reverse is significant to the Ten of Swords. This person is binded to something. They overdid the manipulation and you are the privileged lady. So this person is losing sleep over it. This could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Virgo energy. Privileged lady here. Wow, so the King of Pentacles wants to come towards you, the Privileged Lady. So the King of Pentacles is dealing with the Privileged Lady or is coming towards the Privileged Lady to make the Privileged Lady an offer. So you could be the King of Pentacles watching. You could be very wealthy. You could be in your power. You could be doing something in the public eye and you're attracting this Privileged Lady or you are the Privileged Lady in the public eye attracting this King of Pentacles. Very wealthy individual, power couple energy yeah, because the happy home is in reverse because you had to move away from a situation. So you could attract this sort of abundance. Somebody wanted to keep you trapped or imprisonment. What's the imprisonment here? Is that you have a lot of options and somebody wanted to lie to you, blind you, or block you from knowing the truth. Okay, from knowing about what they did behind the scenes to get you caught up. Wow. Hmm. Yeah, but you're having a major awakening. You're in the hangman mode here. Yep, you are. Yep, because your money's increasing. Okay, so 7-7 seven, seven energy is here. 77 could be somebody's birth year, or 7-7 seven, seven is somebody's number or someone seeing this. Okay, so we're going to pull some energy on this mature male. You're getting the Ace of Cups, baby. You're getting a major blessing, and somebody's headed to prison, or somebody's in the, two of, in the Two of Swords. They're stuck in mental prison. They're stuck in their head about this. How could you be winning? How could you be successful? How could you freaking love yourself? Oh, my God, this is crazy, right? This is how they're feeling or this person's feeling about you. Who is this mature man that the Aries is dealing with? Okay, mature man could be a king of wands. This could be an older family member, someone in your life. This could be an elder. Aries, Leo, Sag, king of wands, mature man. What's going on with this mature man? 
might want to come towards you to make something right with you, make something fair, give you a gift. Or this mature man is having an awakening to something here. Or this mature man, hmm, yeah, bringing you something. The Nine of Cups wants to do something for you, wants to rectify a situation, do right by you. Or this mature man could be passing, leaving you a fortune, or they did. Okay, this, this mature man here. This would be a father, grandfather. It's a, it looks like a male energy, an uncle. Okay, somebody that, um, yeah, this is going to cause you to have a celebration because the truth is out, okay? And you're going to have a lot of options because this mature man could, could have left you a fortune or wealth or could be giving you a gift of fortune or wealth. Somebody's in the Nine of Swords about this because they all tried to block this from happening, so you had to walk away. Yeah, you're getting good news. The lovers, somebody's coming to give you an offer of love. This could be a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Gemini. This could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay, but this person here is coming towards you with the lovers, the Two of Cups, and the Page of Cups. This is a divine counterpart. This is a spiritual union or connection that's happening. This was meant to happen. Okay, maybe the mature man didn't want this to happen. Maybe someone's father figure didn't want them to find love or that they didn't want them to be with you or this mature man is having an awakening that you're the privileged lady and they need to do something right they need to do something right by you they need to make an offer towards you you some of you guys could be dealing with someone that's older than you some of you guys are dealing with someone that's younger okay yeah this is your message aries okay let me get a couple numerology cards before i end this video reading Oh, wait, this ain't it. Okay, well, guess I got to pull this deck, Spirit said, first. Okay, so, uh, shoot, numerology messages. Let me pull a couple of these cards here. Hmm. Secret enemies. You know who these people are. They're being blinded. Somebody wants to marry you. Soulmate connection coming in. Yeah, the secret enemies was trying to steal your money or block you. Block your creativity. Hold back, like hold you back from your purpose. High priestess. You're the high priestess. There could have been a Pisces that was a high priestess in reverse, right? This person is very toxic. This person tried to confuse you. This person pretended that they was spiritual or they wanted to help you in some sort of way. This could have been a pastor, a preacher, a preacher's wife, or somebody in the spiritual community. But this person was low-key working on trying to transfer your energy and 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 come like somehow this person wanted to steal your destiny or transfer your destiny to them or block your destiny wow but you are the high priestess feminine divine feminine energy i heard raquel ricky i heard randy reina i also heard reina separation spells yeah these separation spells that were being done against for you and your person not to come together have been completely broken this person knows who you are yeah the magician this could be a gemini the sun somebody's awakened to this okay yeah completely awakened to it clarified all those cards and that's what comes out can't make it up somebody's coming towards you or you're coming towards somebody and this is a connection that was meant to happen Someone overdid their manipulation. Someone tried to use your own ancestors to come for you. This, this shit is really, uh, it's not going good for someone here. A group of people, right? Yeah. They're being blinded and binded to a situation, right? 677 seven is that your angels are reassuring you. 232 two is that you need to stay focused on your goals, okay? 11, um, 111 is manifesting abundance. You're manifesting abundance and prosperity. And 1212 is that this is your spiritual wake-up call, right? You're a mastermind, okay, and that you are an earth angel or that you are a powerful healer here. You have a powerful purpose. You access the book of secrets here. 474 is, I heard Osiris, Osiris energy here. 474 is that good things are coming to you soon, okay? Yeah, 911, okay? 911 could be significant. Somebody could be a, a born in September or 911 is that somebody's could be calling the police. You got to call the police on someone that tries to come towards you with this, uh, trying to fight you, trying to cause a whole com co conflict with you. Somebody's calling the cops here. 911 is being called or 911. Somebody here might, you might need to get a restraining order on somebody, but it's time to walk away from karmic energies or toxic people. Do it and pursue your goals. Okay. 808 is that you're manifesting abundance. 888 can't make it up. 888, this beautiful energy. Somebody could be born in 88 or 888 is significant, okay? But blessings, money, and miracles here. You, that's what you guys are attracting. This is your message, my loves. Thank you so much for subscribing and watching the content. I love you guys for your love, donation, support. 
Till the next time, my beautiful loves, if you need a personal reading, reach out to me. If you guys want to learn how to read tarot, reach out to me. Those videos are available um, on my channel for um, $25 for three videos to learn to read tarot, okay? Till the next time, my loves. Namaste.